Hey, hi guys, 3D Woody here again with a small little project I wanted to go over. So uh, on Thingiverse they had this uh, uh, called Large uh, Motorized Cube. Uh, I thought it was kind of neat, so uh, I thought I would do that. So this is uh, this is the monster here. It's pretty big. It's a good size. I, I kind of like how big it is. And uh, you put a little motor in it, and it spins around. So I don't have the motors yet. I've ordered them, but uh, I just spin it uh, manually. And uh, I think it's kind of it's kind of neat for a little desktop thing or something for a kid, whatever. Uh, all went together well. Spins well. I heard some people were having some issues with it binding up and stuff. I don't seem to have any issues there. Um, did it all in PLA. Uh, took quite a while to print them up. Um, a lot of the, well, there's uh, what, uh, seven, eight, nine, and about 12 different pieces to it. And I did that over about three days. But, uh, anyways, project worked out well. And uh, I just did it with the standard print head because I'm still on that at the moment. I haven't switched back to the. Uh, the E3D uh, one, but uh, so like I said, the standard print head usually works pretty good uh, if you're just using, uh, uh, not doing anything real fancy, but that that was uh, a good project. It was a lot to print. Um, I think the longest print was 20 hours, uh, and it worked great. Catch you later. Bye.